everybody, it's Dizzy. Welcome to my channel. I am coming at you with like no makeup on and pretty natural today um, because I just didn't feel like putting all that on. Um, I've got a Petty Bauer unboxing for you for the month of June. Petty Bauer is a cruelty-free subscription box you get every month. And let's see what's inside. Okay, so the theme is I'm really a mermaid, which is a theme I can definitely live with. And on the back of the card, it has a list of all the products, um, what they're worth and what their full size is worth. So the first thing I see is this. Suntegrity, enjoy our two of our lip replenishing shades. So it comes with a little card that shows you all the colors, two different little bullets, and then a little lip brush. So let's have a look at these colors. I have used the Suntegrity um, tinted, um, what's the word I'm looking for? The tinted um, sunscreen and it was really nice. So I would definitely use it again. So the two shades I have, one is Sable and that is Sable. is really thick and like hard to get out with the little brush. Let's see. It doesn't really spread well. I think these must have sunscreen or something in them. So that is the world's tiniest swatch of sable. I don't know. I think that this maybe got a little hard in the packaging. Um, and then the other one that I have is Sunburst Pink. So let's see. The pink is a lot smoother and more like a lipstick. So that is the pink. And that's the pink on there. And because I don't have any lip color on at all, So I put it on just as like a sheer, kind of sheer. And the pink is nice. So that one is definitely worth trying out. That other one's texture is just really funky. I'm gonna wipe this off my hand. So if that's any indication, the colors are pretty hit and miss. But like I said, the one that was good was Sunburst Pink, and the one that I did not like was the Sable one. But this is pretty. This is okay. Doesn't really smell like anything. Kind of smells a little bit like sunscreen. But I mean, they're like dramatically different textures between the Sable and the, um, the other one. So that's interesting. We'll have to find out more about that. The next is Juice Beauty Green Apple Brightening SPF 15 Moisturizer. I'm excited. I've used Juice Beauty stuff in the past and found it really nice. I'm gonna just, there's a safety seal, I'm gonna pop that and see if this smells like anything. So it's just a white cream. It does have a smell and it has a little bit of an apple scent, but it's really nice. So I am excited to use that and try it out. Broad Spectrum SPF 15 sunscreen, which is great to have right now. The next thing I see is Precious Skin Elixir Sea Pearl Exfoliating Clay. Powder to Mousse Resurfacing Cleanser. So it is a powder and um, Pour a teaspoon of water into a palm, sprinkle drops of water to activate, pour a teaspoon of powder into the palm, put in drops of water to activate and mix to a creamy texture. So that's interesting. I'm not really a big fan of these like powder add water beauty products, but I will definitely give this one a try. And then the last thing we got is the Smart Volume Leave-In Conditioner by Evolve. And it says it's a thickening leave-in conditioner. So let me tell you what everything is worth. Um, 
So the Green Apple Brightening, which is the Juice Beauty Moisturizer, is $18 and the full size is $38. Juice Beauty stuff is pricey, so it's always exciting to get to try that because it's pretty dang high end. This little sample size of the leave-in conditioner is $11. Um, the Suntegrity Lip Sample is $5. And the uh, lip gloss, like the lipstick itself, is 28, which is pretty pricey, especially for something that, you know, the one that I have on that actually was like emollient and nice feels honestly fantastic, but it doesn't have a lot of color payoff. And the other one, the sable one, I mean, it's it's not good. It's like really hard and waxy, so probably wouldn't get that as a full size. And then the Precious Skin Elixirs, the clay mat, like the clay exfoliator is $4.50 and the full size is $70. Now that's one of the things that I absolutely love about the, um, the Petty Bower box is that you get really high end vegan cruelty free stuff and that's kind of really fun to try. Um, one thing that's, that I just found out about the um, the Suntegrity Lip Care Lipstick is it's SPF 30 and that might be with zinc oxide and that might be why that sable one feels a little bit weird. Maybe there's more of the zinc in that one than there is of the more pinky tone. But there you go. That's my Petty Bower box. I hope that you guys enjoyed seeing me do this unboxing. I'll put a link below to Petty Bower because I think if you like cruelty-free products, they are definitely worth a shot. And I'll see you guys next time. Bye.